guys? Mega Movie Man Mark here, and welcome to the new segment I like to call Blind Movie News. It's where I get handed a bunch of news articles from a beautiful woman over there. She would be on camera if she wasn't camera shy, but you know, what can I do? <laughs> but she's real. So she's gonna hand me some stuff, I'm gonna take a second to look at it, and I'll give you my reactions to it. It could be anything that's happening in the world of movies today, which is September... 18. Here's the first article. Pixar's The Good Dinosaur pushed back nearly 18 months after losing director. What? Pushed back nearly 18 months? Dude, that's like seven years. This really sucks. I mean, maybe some people aren't too shocked because the director left, but 18 months? The guy says, people don't remember when a movie gets pushed back, but people remember when a movie's bad. So he's saying that good, The Good Dinosaur was bad. Ouch. Huh. That's a tough one. Alright, next article. No Pixar film in 2014. This is the same thing. Good Dinosaur and Finding Dory both delayed a year. Wait. Finding Dory. Oh, I should have known. I should have known. I should have known. <laughs> now that one I was looking forward to. They crossed the line. Wow. I, I feel some tears coming up. Imagine in 10 years we're looking back and we're like, Ah, The Good Dinosaur and Finding Dory. Remember we were scared about those movies because they got delayed? <laughs> they met all the fish in the sea in the first one. What else can you do? Pixar just had a light bulb. Oh, there's other fish in the sea that we're going to research. I guarantee that's what the movie's going to be. Oh, well, look at this new fish that you've never heard of. Look at this one. Oh, they're meeting each other. But I actually was excited for it just for that reason, to see what they're going to do. Nothing good to say. Wow. See this? Bye bye Finding Dory, I hope you don't get delayed again and I can see you before I die! Final news story of the day, Angelina Jolie's Maleficent has its release date moved up. Alright, this is the Disney movie. Okay, so I, you know, you delay two movies, you bring one up. Uh, by the way, for those of you who don't know, ever since Alice in Wonderland, they want to redo some of their Disney movies. And Maleficent is the movie about the villain that turns into a dragon that scared everyone as a kid in the movie Sleeping Beauty. So it's based on just her character. Uh, so that could be cool. I guess. Hopefully she turns into a dragon and doesn't look like the one in Enchanted because that would be pretty cheesy for a 2014 movie. This will allow Maleficent to have a calmer opening weekend avoiding Transformers Age of Extinction and Fast and Furious 7 along with the World Cup, which is slated during that time as well. All right, cool, so those are our three Disney stories for today. Thanks, lady, for bringing these up for me. What's your name again? I'm, I can't hear her, she's camera shy, so. And while we're at it, I just thought of this right now, why don't we talk about the new trailer for Toy Story of Terror, the TV special. Now, I know I should be jumping up and down because I love Toy Story so much, and I am, really I am, but I've been anticipating this since last October, and it's a 30 second trailer, it's not a full length movie either, so it's not that much to be super excited for, um, like a, like a, like a movie, but I'm excited for it because it's Pixar's first TV thing, my jogger. If there was nothing about Toy Story since Toy Story 3, three years ago, seeing this would be like, the toys are back in town, toys are back in town, ah. but they've always been in town, like they haven't been gone. That's what they should do for Toy Story 4. When they finally release that, which they will, they will, like just accept that. I, there's been all these rumors, they've signed on the cast, it's happening. <laughs> I mean, it's happening. John Lasseter, whenever he's asked about it, he's like, speaking of Cars 2, I love that movie. We're talking about Toy Story. I'm kind of looking forward to a Toy Story 4. Uh, just to see where they go with it, but watching that Toy Story 3 ending again a few days ago, I've seen that movie a lot of times, and for this, like, tenth viewing of the movie, I cried again, like, the same as I did in the theaters. It was weird. I guess it was because I watched it on Blu-ray, and all the other times I just watched it on DVD. <laughs> the picture quality adds to the experience, doesn't it? The thing that gets me most excited in this whole trailer is this shot right there. I don't know why, it just makes me think this is an adventure. Let me know, are you excited for Finding Dory, The Good Dinosaur, Maleficent, or Toy Story of Terror the most? Which one? For me, it's Toy Story of Terror by default, because I love Toy Story. 
And also, I got a Facebook page. It's facebook.com slash megamoviemanmark. Give it a like below. And a Twitter as well, at moviemanmark. I am mega, but the mega could not fit. All right, guys, that's all the time I got for today. But remember, subscribing to Mega Movie Man Mark is mega cool.